Today we're going to talk about the contact point and why you should stay with the ball longer. Staying with the ball longer means that while the ball is on your racket, you have no movement to any other side except towards the direction where you actually want to hit. That is why it's really important to stay in balance when you hit your shot. One way to visualize it and practice it is to imagine as if you're hitting not one ball, but four balls in a row. You can place four tennis balls on the ground and do a shadow drill where you move up to your balls. They have to be in front of your right foot like this. If I'm in an open stance, if I'm in a closed stance, then they should be in front of my left foot, but I'll show you the open stance first. So you line up yourself so they're on a fair distance on your side. You move your racket towards the ball and you try to stay with your racket through all these balls longer. Then you try to make this movement faster, but still keeping this direction right here. I want you guys to imagine that you're hitting all four balls in the same direction so that your racket faces and moves in the same direction throughout this whole path. Once you did enough of these shadow drills and you have an understanding, like you know what you're looking for, then when you hit real tennis balls, you just try to imitate the same thing that you did. This will help you to control the depth and the height of the ball more easily so you become more consistent and better at placing the ball. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe and we'll see you guys soon.